A recap of ITA Team National Indoors. Started on Friday uh, with uh, the number one seed in Emory. Um, played them, obviously, many times before. Um, but we came out very strong. Had a great double showing. Actually won our number one doubles. Um, and then won our number three doubles as well with our seniors, uh, Chaz and Nemo. And they actually took out the fall ITA uh, national champions, um, so that was a that was a big time win. But uh, ultimately, Emory then came out in singles and, and proved a little too strong on that day. So we went into Saturday, and we now had a double header since we lost that first match. Um, and the first match on Saturday, we played against the host team, Case Western. Uh, again, we came out and played some great doubles. Uh, and we're just really unlucky not to be up 3-0 after doubles. We won at line one and three again. Number two's lost again in a tiebreaker. It was a highly competitive match, um, but Case proved a little more resilient than we were that day. Um, and they ultimately ended up getting four of the singles matches, and uh, we only got two. Um, and so we ended up losing that one 5-4. You know, the guys ultimately rallied together. Um, and uh, we're determined to, to end the tournament on a high note. The third match of the tournament, second match of the day, was against Kenyon. And on this one, our guys were just determined not to lose. And we wanted to, to finish the trip um, the right way and, uh, and go home on a positive. So we, we came out again, got two out of the three doubles. This time our twos came out victorious. Our threes continued to roll. We ended up with a 6-3 win uh, over Kenyon. So we finished seventh. Not exactly the place we were hoping for, but again, uh, good, good learning experience and you know, ultimately sets us up well for the rest of the season.